Hurricane Michael sent families fleeing the panhandle. When they returned, they found their lives were forever changed. After Hurricane Michael, Alex Noble not only had to move homes, but schools. He transferred to Arnold High School from Mosley. His family had evacuated. I moved in with a friend that goes to this school, Liam Bird, and uh, his family took care of me and let me live with them for probably close to six months after the hurricane, and my family was still up in Arkansas, so it was kind of hard not being with my family. Noble says after the storm, he wanted to come back right away. Just being away was hard, just kind of seeing it through the news and everything, and like knowing I had a lot of friends and people that were in the area still, and just like wanting to come back and um, help and like try to clean up and all that stuff, just it was a big, big deal for me. He also plays football and will play his former school for the last game of the season. That'll be intense, yeah, so I have, I'll have a lot to prove in that game. Bonnie Rose Dietrich evacuated the morning of Hurricane Michael. At first, I didn't take it that seriously, like we weren't even going to evacuate, and then, and then it was more scary whenever everything actually hit, and then I couldn't even get in contact with anybody. I just started freaking out because I just I didn't even know which of my friends were like okay and like alive or anything. Over a week after the storm, Dietrich and her family returned to their neighborhood. Just trees everywhere in the yard, and like going upstairs and seeing my window shattered and like mold on the walls. It was crazy. Dietrich says she's learned who will actually be there for the community after a devastating event like Hurricane Michael. People coming together that didn't before, and then some people just like uh, not really caring about other people as much as they thought they did, I would say. So like it's really discovering like who's really there. Kelly Grossfield, News 13, Panhandle Strong.